Hey guys, welcome to Agrarian Skies with Tony and myself, Mind Herpes. We've got started a little bit. Um, we had to test out the server um, to make sure that um, everything was working right. So we planted a tree already and we um, grew it and we harvested it and we turned in the first quest, which was using the book. Um, we just wanted to make sure everything was working right before we went live with the series. So, it's all working good. So, here, so I want to start off with the next one here, is the manual completion, just to carve some more wood. We grow a tree, and we'll go from there. As you can see with the wood that we harvest from before, I made these planks to make it much easier so we don't waste so much hunger going up and down by jumping. There's another person playing on the server. He's got his own island. Um, so you may see someone chat back and forth. But there is another person that's playing. Let's close the door. There we go. Let's turn this in. Manual submit. Let's claim the reef. Uh, Tony will join us on TeamSpeak here in a little bit, uh, but until then, I'm going to be typing to him. Let's see, what's what the book binder is. Let's see here. Paper and string. Now it's going to be a while. See if he wants to do it. I don't want to be doing the one doing them all since this is a co-op. Go ahead and set that bad boy down. Let's go see if any sappings dropped. Nothing. Let's get a crook. Make Tony one as well. So it looks like we got one more here, and when I planted it, I'm gonna save the bone meal for when we need it. I want to make sure we don't lose the one sapling that we have if I want to make the crook. There we go. Try not to keep a bunch of stuff on me since we are playing on hardcore here. And, um, I don't want to die. I 
Alright, we'll be back once we get ready to start the quest delivery system quest. Alright guys, we're back. We're getting ready to finish this quest here, the QDS quest. And Tony's going to do it here. Just so we can show how it's done. There we go. Yay! Now we have to give the hopper back. I got it, sorry. So then how do I give it back? I just manually submitted it. Yeah, oh, that's probably how. So something I've noticed, make sure you hover over the full hearts to make sure it's just consume. Because there are rotten hearts that take a life away. Right. Oh, I got the decor reward. A bunch of different colored bricks. Basic. In my bag. Ooh, I got punji sticks. That'll be useful once we build our mob spawner. Gotcha. <laughs> In the beginning, we need to build a parts builder, tool station, and an oak barrel. I've already got the crook made, a chest made, and the crafting station made. I'll hop on the part builder and the uh, uh, tool station. All right, I'll do the barrel. Oak barrel's done. I'm going to need a log for the part builder. Do we have a tree out there? Yeah, I have it growing. I'll, I'll expedite its growth. The achievement of getting wood. Woohoo! As you can see, I <laughs> made us some one. stairs so we don't use so much hunger to getting up into the house. Right. Yeah, we need this quest. I need some apples. I'm down three. Alright guys, we'll be back once we're ready to hand this quest in. Alright guys, when we're back, we got everything made. I think that 100%. I'm gonna select the Axe of Despair. I'm 
I'll go with the Pan of Destiny then. Perfect. Ten apples. Finally, some food. I put the heart in the strong box. And I got a basic reward bag. Let's see what we got. I got a mysterious magnet. Level 8. I'm going to put that in the chest for right now so I don't lose it. Ooh, we got a silkworm. Nice. Yep, got that from that last tree I took down. That's awesome. All right, let's see what's next on the agenda. I need to make a, a sieve, a fishing rod, a hammer, and a bed. So we need to use that one silkworm and a tree to gain string. Which it looks like it's still raining. Well, I'm going to go ahead and use some more bone meal to grow this tree up. So that way we can um, put that silkworm on it so it can start expanding. Alright. Nice size tree there for the silkworm. I got the silkworm. You already, did you, did you already plant one? Alright, I'm planting the silkworm. Okay, it's infesting. You can see it right there. Nice. And it's nighttime, and our island's not safe, so I'm going to put the door up, and we'll come back once it's day. Alright guys, and we're back. A um, couple things we did while we were away. Um, we made the part builder, stencil table, and the tool station half slabs, and put them up there with the crafting table, just so we have more room on the ground. And Tony forgot that he had a rewards bag, and we got some plum saplings, so we planted the tree here to give us some early game food. Um, we came out here to check on our tree, and it appears that the entire tree is infested now with silkworm. I think we're going to go ahead and harvest it, and hope for the best. Alright, we got the nine strings so far and another silkworm. We're going to need to plant another tree uh, to get our bed and whatnot.
And we now got 24 stream. That's awesome. I have no idea the answer to Danny's question because you did it. <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't matter. I don't, as far as I know, it doesn't matter which tree it is. Uh, it only matters how many saplings you have. You don't get any saplings in return. Right. Alright, so let's see what we need here. Should we make the bed first, or should we make the fishing? We might have enough for everything, I doubt it though. I'm not sure. You're gonna need 12 uh, string just for the bed alone. The fishing rod at least cures our hunger, so I'd put that ahead of the bed probably. Yeah, it's, at least it's not a consumed task, that's nice. Right. I just made. I just got the wool for the. I'm making the wool for the bed. Ah. Be right back. I need caffeine. Copy. Okay. All right, never mind. It's right by my feet. All right. We have a bed! I feel like... I feel like a noob looking up a fishing rod, but with as many recipes that changed in this mod, I just want to make sure we do it right. Right. Fishing rod is the same. We have a fishing rod. Sweet. Want me to go fish for you? Sure, there's the fishing rod. Alright, we'll go get us some food. In the wild seas of our four block water reservoir. <laughs> yes, remember to to cast straight up so it falls straight down so you don't hit any land and waste the durability on the fishing rod. Gotcha. This is the most hilarious fishing trip I've ever been on in Minecraft. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we need not we need eight more strings so I can make the sieve. All right, guys, we'll be back. Once the tree grows and we get the tree infested. Alright guys, we're back. While we were gone, I created the wooden hammer. It was just two sticks and two planks. So that was pretty easy. And so now I'm going to get ready to harvest the um, infested leaves off the tree to get more strength. I thought I'd try sleeping, but I, I don't think anybody else has a bed yet. Alright guys, sorry about that. I want to do a quick log so we can make it day so it wasn't so dangerous around here now that we have a bed.
I had to get higher up here so I could reach that top leaf. Alright, we can replant the tree now. Once I chop down the logs here and we can turn this quest in. As you make the sieve. Now, what rewards are we picking here? Oh, for sure the sugar cane, so we can do the uh, book binder, and we also need to either pick the carrots or the regular seed, so we can either make eat carrots or eat. Um, bread so we have a renewable food source. I'm gonna guess carrots are probably the better option there. Oh crap, we need stone. Alright, so this is a two-parter guys, so um, we have to make stone. So let me read through here real quick and figure out how to do that. All right, looks like I have to sift dirt. Oh, that'll be good. So I put a piece of dirt in. And I got four stone. Oh, hey, that ain't bad. And that gave me a piece of cobble. All right, we're ready to turn in. I'm gonna grab the sugar canes, you grab carrot or regular seeds. Alrighty. I'll grab carrots. Sounds good to me. And while we were gone, Tony also used the fishing pole that we made for the quest to get some fish out of our water source over there, so now we have six fish. Um, if we had more dirt, we would use more dirt to... Um, well, we have dirt, we may have to unclog, unblock the windows and doors and use that dirt to make a farm and to make more cobble so we make a furnace but um, at least we've got some sugar cane seeds and some carrot seeds i'm also gonna make this full heart would you like to consume it since i did the last one sure give us an extra life Yay, likiness! Yay! Seven is much more than four. Man, that unlocked a lot. We need to get sand, gravel, and dust. I'm gonna go ahead and do uh, another. Which quest are we on? I'm gonna do another dirt. This... Alright. Yep, yep, I was just looking at that. I'm gonna go ahead and claim a reward. I'm gonna pick. Looks like Tony already did the fishing trip one by fishing, so we're just going to randomly pick one. I picked the third one from the left. Claim reward. Ooh, I got a stone axe of, with ban of arthropods five. And a re fishing pod. I got four slimy saplings from my uh, bag. Sweet, we're going to need those later in the game. I got nutmeg saplings. Wow, a cooked fish restores one whole haunch. Might as well eat it. Yep. I'm out of apples. we got to figure out a way to hopefully cook these fish soon. 
take these two dirt and start us a carrot farm. All right. I'm going to take the other two dirt and sift them and try to get enough stone so I can do the next quest. How do I till the land to plant, plant the carrots? Um, let me make a yeah, hoe. I was to say, do we have enough wood for a hoe? I believe so. Let me find out. Yes, we do. Got an achievement. On the stairs. Now I need sand and dust. Man, I need more dirt. Thanks. Hate to waste the dirt, but we need it. Right. Alright, I'm gonna hammer it. Got gravel, gonna hammer it again. And now I got saved. Ooh, got some seeds. We got some melon seeds now. Ooh, melons. Love me some good big melons. Wait, what? Ooh, <laughs> melons. Alright, I'm gonna turn dust turn this into dust now. I think I'm ready to hand in, yep. I'm gonna. Should we take the heart or the re reward bag? I'm leaning towards the reward bag. Probably. I took the last one. We now have eight lives remaining. Nice. Only Danny could have so many issues. <laughs> All right. Oh, so we spot, got though. dirt, dust, cobble, and sand. <laughs> I'm going to bone meal the carrot. There you go, behind you. Does he need to put it into the leaves? Or... Almost forgot about my reward bag. I got a spiked pick. Um, cactus pickaxe head. Um, durability 150. Spiny, mining speed 5. Um, a thomic binding. Netherrack tool rod.
So my plan is I'm going to save the um, the cobble for a furnace when we get to that point. But I'm going to sift the everything else. Ooh, I got some ores. One thing I've learned, folks, is this mod pack is definitely not for the faint of heart. <laughs> I got Sirtis Quartz, Crushed Gold, and Crushed Iron, and Crushed Tin. Whoa. That's what I call yield. Nothing from that one. All right, I'm gonna do the sand, uh, the gravel now. From that one, I got broken aluminum and two flint. And now the dust. Was that blaze powder I just saw? Yes, it was. I got pulverized silver, pulverized gold, pulverized copper, pulverized iron, and blaze powder. Winning! Want to do yours? Save the cobble, though. I don't, um, is there anything left to sift? Didn't you get any? From when you mm -hmm. handed in the quest? Which quest? I might not have turned it in. It was... Be resourceful. Oh, yep, I didn't turn it in. That explains why you didn't have any. So you should get... One of... You should get a dust, a gravel, a cobble, and a sand. Save the cobble, though. And I got two nether fish from my reward bag. Nice. I have no clue what those do, but I'm hanging on to them. I'm going to make another chest here for all our ores. I got a bone meal, a gunpowder, and a pulverized tin. Let me to log real quick. You can. All right, guys, I'll be back once we get ready for the next quest. All right, guys, we're back. Um, so kind of recap what happened. We cut down the tree. We put the barrel outside so that way next time it rains, it will fill the barrel up so we can start creating some dirt. We got the um, plum tree to grow so that way we can get some food because that's where dire need for food. Um, the carrots have grown a little bit. And that's basically where we've gotten so far. Um, I've been looking through the quest book here, and I see there's one quest that we can do. Survival is not tasty. Um, all we need to do is make a sifter. So that's what I'm going to do now. If I can grab the right amount of strength.